Hey there! Today's video is all about the top three supplements that can help reverse insulin resistance and are under $25 each, berberine, inositol, and chromium. If you've watched any of my other videos, you know that the mainstream nutrition guidelines imposed on us are the reason we stay chronically ill and overweight. Because our nutrition is so bad, adding certain supplements can help reduce chronic inflammation and get your blood sugar and insulin back to where they should be for optimal health. So let's talk about the top three supplements and how to know if they are right for you. Before we get into that, let me introduce myself. My name is Julie and I'm a former health coach and after years of following the traditional diet rules, I found myself very sick and overweight. I had to figure it out on my own and I'm on a mission to help others by sharing what I learned. What I share goes against the narrative because I believe the narrative is why we stay sick and fat. If you're interested in taking control of your metabolic health, make sure to click that subscribe button. The first supplement is berberine. If you've watched my other videos, you know I absolutely love berberine and its impact on lowering blood sugar. It's a yellow colored alkaloid that can be found in several plants. It has been used in traditional medicine for centuries and is believed to have numerous health benefits, one being it helps our bodies break down sugar within our cells. It also decreases sugar production and improves insulin sensitivity. Berberine is often recommended as an alternative to the prescription drug metformin as it has been shown to be as effective with fewer side effects. The second supplement is inositol, which is also known as bioinositol or vitamin B8. Most people consume about one gram of it a day through various foods. However, it gets depleted in our body when our blood sugar is high, which can be caused by insulin resistance. Inositol plays a key role in insulin signaling and sensitivity. So when you're insulin resistant, you get stuck in a cycle where inositol is becoming depleted, causing you to become less insulin sensitive, and in turn, depleting inositol further. It is also shown to support a healthy mood and cognitive function and improve hormonal balance in the body. Finally, chromium. Chromium is an essential mineral that plays a role in the regulation of insulin and the metabolism of carbs, protein, and fat. It enhances your cell's response to insulin and improves insulin sensitivity. Chromium deficiency has also been linked to insulin resistance. Supplementation might be necessary even though chromium is found in foods. Many people still don't get enough of it. Most people don't get enough minerals because our food has been so genetically modified, but that's another video for another day. If there's something specific you'd like to know about, drop me a comment. Now, as I hinted about earlier, our dietary guidelines are meant to keep us sick, fat, and let me add, has made us dependent on big food and big pharma. This is why you may need some extra help reversing insulin resistance. Making small changes to your diet can go a long way in improving your health, but sometimes diet isn't enough and you need some extra help getting rid of years of inflammation to get that insulin and blood sugar back to optimal levels. So those are the top three supplements for insulin resistance, berberine, inositol, and chromium. Remember, diet is still the most important factor, but adding these supplements to your routine can enhance your results. If you're interested in trying them out, make sure to consult your healthcare provider first. I hope you found this video helpful, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos on insulin resistance, weight loss, and more. Thanks for watching.